football. Luton 2 could go down tomorrow if they lose at home to Plymouth. It's been a week of turmoil at Kenilworth Road with an FA inquiry into finances. But today, some potentially good news. A new owner has taken over, David Pigney from Harpenden, mainly known as a motor racing driver. There haven't been too many champagne moments at Kenilworth Road the last few months, but the new owner, David Pinkney, hopes they're on there their way go. back. We're going to take it hopefully to a new stadium and one day hopefully back into the Premiership. That's, that's the goal. That'll take a lot of financial clout. Have you got it? It depends how I want to spend it, doesn't it? Um, it will take a lot of financial clout, but you know, there's other people that are prepared to come on board and help us. Um, I'm prepared to spend relatively what it needs to have um, and you know it's about getting good guys on board and and working to the future really building it. Kevin Blackwell knew all about Pinkney's vision for the club before he agreed to be boss. He has a sporting background he knows about how to develop uh, the product in terms of sport and that's important as a manager to know you've got a chairman who thinks along those lines. Pinkney is more well known for motor racing. This year he's driving in the British Touring Car Championship, the next leg at Rockingham next weekend. His passion may be motor racing, but he says he's a Luton fan as well. Bill Tomlin stepped aside this week in the wake of an FA inquiry, but other board members will be staying on board. But fans might want me to ask you if, as a result of the inquiry, that you're going to come out squeaky clean as well. Well, all I can say to, to any Luton fan and to any Luton fan, I understand the, some of the comments that have been made, um, but all I can say is that uh, you know, I can look at myself in the mirror and know I'm absolutely comfortable with my position here at Luton Town Football Club. The Hatters have not been blessed with happy times of late and his first match at the helm will be at home to Plymouth tomorrow, a day the club could be relegated. The boss knows all about the rivalries with Plymouth as well. But how you can get a local rivalry 400 miles apart is, uh, is good news to me. You and Ian Holloway aren't going to follow on the Starrick and Kinnear one. No, no, myself and Ollie will be having a drink afterwards, that's for sure. I mean, listen, maybe before. It's about the fans, isn't it? And you're not going to let them down? I'm not. No, I'm going to try my hardest to give them the best we can possibly give them in all aspects. Today, of course, is Friday the 13th. Luton fans will hope it's not an omen. And this man really is the driving force to take Luton to a brighter future.